We are going to uh, go off script a little bit, and we're going to split up this next question because there's just way too many things to answer in one little question. So, do you support the unequivocal enforcement of all federal immigration laws that are already on the books, and do you support the completion of a wall on the border between the U.S. and Mexico? And we'll be first to Susan. Jerry answered that last one first, so it'll be yep. first to you. The first part was about the laws on the books today. Well, absolutely. Absolutely. If we would enforce our laws that are on the books today, we wouldn't have almost 2 million people a year coming over our border illegally. And that's not fair for us, but it's not fair for them either. So we absolutely should not um, ever, ever um, vary from that. Uh, yes, I believe in building the rest of the wall. I think there should be the rest of the wall. If you take a look at every other country in the world, all of them have borders. There's a reason for that, you know, and we do have to address additional, um, you know, the enforcement of the laws. But then we really do have to look at why um, they are coming in. There should be immigration. I am a second generation immigrant to the United States. So we absolutely need to have immigration. We just need to do it by the books. I, I'm a firm believer in the uh, validity of the rule of law. So I, I believe that first and foremost, we need to enforce the laws that are uh, on our books. Um, but I, I think we also need to look at immigration comprehensively. For far too long, we've been ruling this country by executive order. And what we saw under President Trump is all of the executive orders that he put in place were gone on day one of the Biden administration. And we've seen this influx of illegal immigration ever since. So I support securing the border by building a wall where, where we can, and then everywhere else, you put boots on the ground and drone technology, and we've got to close up the porous border. Um, and we need to get to a point where uh, we eliminate sanctuary cities, we make them illegal, at the federal level, if, in, and the only way to do that is legislatively because President Trump tried to do it by executive order and he was unsuccessful. Thank you. So I absolutely believe in following the rule of law, especially when it comes to immigration law. Number one, we need to make sure the wall at the border is fully built every single area where Immigrations and Customs Enforcement wants it to be built. Because not only is that the right thing to do in terms of immigration, but it's, it's actually the compassionate thing to do. All the people that are dying because of drug overdoses, overdoses or fentanyl overdoses, because drug cartels are becoming rich off of a lack of activity from the Joe Biden administration. The Joe Biden administration is MIA, and people are dying because of that. Sex trafficking victims are being created every single day because of the Joe Biden administration. So we need to finish the wall. I also care tremendously about things like E-Verify. We need to also end catch and release in this nation. It doesn't make any sense that someone comes over the border illegally and then they catch a few of them and then they give them a court date years down the road. That doesn't make any sense whatsoever. We need to end catch and release uh, and people need to be sent back if they cross the border illegally. Thank you so much.